Welcome to this online course on centrifugal compressors. Centrifugal compressors of various designs and applications are encountered nowadays throughout petroleum refining, petrochemical, and process industries. These dynamic machines are highly sensitive to the gas operating conditions at their inlet. Operating parameters such as pressure, temperature, compressibility, molecular weight, specific heat ratio of the gas, and compressor rotational speed strongly affect the performance of these machines. This online course will illustrate how to use the performance curves and a set of equations to calculate the effects of changes in these operating parameters. This will give you the necessary tools to understand, evaluate, and predict both compressor performance and behavior for a successful operation of your plant and piping system. The course is designed around a series of practical examples, which we work through to a solution. It is built with three sections. In the first section, we begin by examining the effect of one inlet condition change on compressor performance. We discuss the different equations involved and how to manipulate them. Then we shift our attention to the effect of multiple inlet condition changes. In the second section, we present an engineering approach of how to adjust a compressor rated performance curve to actual inlet conditions. This is an important and valuable learning, as compressor manufacturers supply performance curve of their machines at rated inlet conditions only. Any deviation from the rated inlet conditions will render the rated performance data inaccurate. Lastly, in the third section, we cover the important concept of system resistance. Centrifugal compressors, just like centrifugal pumps, must be designed to comply with the needs of the system. Their operating point is actually defined as the equilibrium condition that exists between the head produced by the compressor and the head required by the system. Centrifugal compressors react to changes in system resistance. For example, in a piping system, this could be changes in tank pressures or valve openings. Changes in system resistance will move centrifugal compressors on their performance curves. Because of this, we say that the system controls the compressor. And if the system makes the compressor do what it cannot do, then the compressor becomes problematic. This section will provide you with valuable insights into how to account for system resistance changes on compressor performance in terms of volume flow and head output. Also included in this online course, a valuable Excel workbook. This workbook provides qualitative and quick comparisons and application notes for centrifugal compressors. It describes calculations and procedures to predict performance characteristics, especially compressor head, discharge pressure, and power, in addition to valuable engineering charts and diagrams. So, with no further ado, check out the free preview videos and the curriculum of the course, and we look forward to seeing you in the first section. Thank you for watching. We hope to see you there.